हेलो एंड वेलकम टू न्यूज एटीन सो शाज लव हुआ आई एम चिराग साइगल एंड जॉइनिंग मी टुडे इज दिव्या अग्रवाल विद अ फ्योन से अपूर्व थैंक यू सो मच गाइज फॉर जॉइनिंग इज हाउ यू गुड थैंक यू सो मच बट आई वॉन्ट टू बिगिन बाई आस्किंग वॉट वॉज योर लव हुआ मोमेंट I would like you to answer this. I would rather. Not. Your love, your moment. How should I answer? No, no. I, I mean, both of you. Ah, uh, I don't know. I think it. I, there was no not a particular moment. I think it was very yeah. gradual over the time. I can't put a finger on a particular date and say it probably happened at this time. Yeah. I think I'm still falling in love. It's not ended. On mm-hmm. every day passing, no, there is something other that keeps happening. Oh, blushing. <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm just listening. <laughs> But I mean, we guys know that you guys know each other for years now. When and where did you guys uh, first meet? We first met at his um, at his uh, uh, bar, I would say, in Vashi. He has a bar in Vashi, and वहाँ पे मैं गई थी for an event. Of course, after an event, we had a uh, event ka after party there, and yeah. then that's where I met him. And he looked quite poised and quite a gentleman. Hi, of course. I was like, I just remember that moment very clearly. So did you know us time ki she is an actress a reality show super No she wasn't I wasn't at all was. So oh, it was video, before that No 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 that was the first uh, that was the first stone in the stepping stone, stepping stone yeah, in the actually to success Yeah that was my it first was. stepping stone that event was actually a beauty pageant I won recently So, it so was if, very if new. I thought uh, if I knew if, if she was probably a celeb then I wouldn't have been so receptive probably <laughs> <laughs> You would have been hesitant I, uh, yeah. I would have had my preconceived notions towards things so <laughs> but now that you live with her i'm sure those preconceived notions are gone <laughs> yeah so that's what uh, as she's uh, she had a tag of a reality queen yeah. uh, being the big boss winner i live in one i have not seen one so <laughs> that's how it is for me no so it's it's a very beautiful thing uh, to live in together to do things together yeah and uh, It's very different to come across these lights. I'm not used to them. <laughs> I'm, they are used to it, but we are not. Yeah. So, yeah, but it's nice. It's no no complaints as such. No it's good enough. But do you guys remember your first date? I I don't I don't I don't think so. It it was like a date date sort of a thing. Mm. I think we just casually met for dinner. We wanted to speak. We wanted to know yeah. about each other, mm. and um, I think we met again at his restaurant only. It was very convenient that time. Yeah. <laughs> like, to just go to his restaurant and just eat, uh, and he was uh, because it was his restaurant. So he was trying new new things. Mm-hmm. He try karo, wo try karo. I still remember the first time actually we were sitting, and मुझे मैंने sushi sushi कुछ नहीं खाई थी उस time पे ठीक है. I had no idea what sushi is. Okay, I was a very Indian food type of a girl. So he's like, uh, did you would you would you like to eat sushi? I said, yeah. I don't know. I've never tried it. I'm like, okay, fine. Then he just he just. took something from the plate and like with the chopsticks like eat it and i just had a bite it was wasabi mere kaan khul gaye the meri aankhein khul gayi thi i've never had such a thing in my life my eyes were blasted abhi tak bhugat raha uska nahi shut up i'm still paying for it so, i remember that on the first date as i said can't call it a date it was a yeah. dinner but it was traumatic for me i still remember the wasabi taste abhi bhi tension jab bhi wasabi dekhti mujhe wahi yaad aata hai she says it was traumatic for her <laughs> <laughs> oh it was fun i would love, now she identifies wasabi if she wouldn't i would still love to do it again yeah. the face was beautiful <laughs> but, but you like you come from the entertainment industry right. you are you're used to hectic work schedules right. everything when you started to date apurv uh, did you take those conscious efforts to make sure ki acha i have to text him also mm-hmm. i have to meet him so right. that he feels ki yes i'm interested no i think it was not a conscious effort it was always in a, uh, it was always a habit like as soon as i get free yeah. i would call him and he would also keep a check on me if she if her work is done or her work is not done in fact uh, you know we think like that that oh i'm always so busy in my hectic schedule aisa kuch nahi hota we we at least mere liye for my work at least i have that much of uh, command over my work ke ha ये ये डेट्स दिए उसके बाद देन आई हैव फ्री टाइम उसके बाद आई हैव दिस टाइम दैट टाइम बट विद हिम लाइक एक्चुअली ही इज मोर बिजी देन मी लाइक बिकॉज यू नो ब्रीदिंग इन बिजनेस इज नॉट इजी आई कैन स्टिल स्किप माई वर्क टू मोर इफ आई वॉन्ट टू बट ही कैन नॉट इट्स लाइक अ बिजनेस यू हैव टू बी देर 
So yeah. it's it's more difficult for him. But yeah, we always get back after the work, and we're excited yeah. to meet each other. That's what I wanted to come to Apoorva also. Uh, I mean, you are you are the owner of your own business. She has to be somewhere at a specific time. Yeah. If there are work trips, everything. Initially, was it also difficult for you to understand that why can't she just reply instantly or ans- answer calls instantly? No, that was okay. Initially, it was very difficult to understand that she said, "My pack up will be at 10:00 a.m." I said, "Okay, great. We'll see you at 10:30. Pack up will be at 3:00 a.m." And I'm not used to that. Like for me, yeah. 10 is 10. I can understand a little. Like, how does 10 happen? Like, how does 10 happen? Then eventually I started realizing that if it's 10 o'clock, then I'm going to eat dinner at 9 o'clock. I'll have a first round of meal. It's going to take a few more hours. So that was more difficult than the texting. Yeah. But texting, I think, she used to manage. And most of the times, I was the one who couldn't reply yeah. more than her doing it. Is it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Actually, because I'm, I'm, um, you know, um, as I said, I can still, you know, in the middle of the shots, we have time. Yeah. We can check our phones. Yeah. We have people around to pass our phones and tell us that, "Hi, yeah, where, where." With him, that's not the case. And but the packer pala thing, to oh my god, it it actually took a lot of time to make him realize that no, one shot is long, it's not going to happen. No, it's going to go, it's going to go, it's going to go. Cut again, cut again, and that takes long. Of course, it's over. It's time. Yeah. <laughs> but what is the longest you have waited for her? I have waited for. Uh, I think your last shoot. I think it got extended by two days. <laughs> so from 10 to 3 <laughs> it yeah it was supposed to end two days before yeah. actually two days she was yeah. she's not in bombay yeah. and uh, the funny part was where she was shooting was in uh, dew so they had only one flight a day to bombay yeah. so if it got delayed the next day so, yeah, next evening yeah. this was happening when शो को एक दिन एक्सटेंड हो गया था बट देन द फ्लाइट हैज टू बी ओनली लाइक वन फ्लाइट अ डे तो तीन बजे की फ्लाइट से तो फिर आई हैड टू वेट एन एंड एंड इट वाज हिज बर्थडे एक्चुअली दैट टाइम व्हेन आई वाज कमिंग बैक एंड आई एम नॉट बिग ऑन बर्थडे शी इज बिग ऑन माय बर्थडे या आई एम द वन दैट डोंट वांट टू हैव केक आल्सो आई एम एब्सोल्युटली ओके बट नाउ यू अंडरस्टैंड हाउ द प्रोफेशन वर्क्स हाउ द इंडस्ट्री वर्क्स नो आई डोंट अंडरस्टैंड आई शुड नॉट आई हैव जस्ट कम टू टर्म्स विद लाइक मे बी सो लेट मी रीफ्रेम इट नाउ मे बी यू हैव अ बेटर अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ हाउ इट वर्क्स इनिशियली Did, I mean, did it also irritate you sometimes? That absolutely. Why can't she be on time? No, I realized it was not in her hands first. Yeah. Uh, for me, I am someone. If I'm going to bed tonight, I have my entire schedule at the back of my head. Yeah. By the minute, what's going to happen? What? So there are times when I'm actually doing two meetings side by side. When I know this person is going to be delayed, I give a 4 p.m. time to two people. I mean, one will come at four o'clock. So that's how I am calculative when it comes to time. He's very calculative at times. So. And when it comes to her, it is like she doesn't have a say. I don't blame it to her. Yeah. I have been to the sets a few times. सब लोग ये ऐसा करते हैं. I'm like, what's what, called call time is at seven. People turn up at nine. So why do you even call it a call time? <laughs> I think they start calling at seven, so people come at nine. That's why it's called a call time. Yeah. But like time is one thing, but. Say, for, if somebody is from the industry, they have a better understanding of various things. In comparison to somebody who is not from the industry, have you guys ever had a conversation which was probably say very normal for you, Divya, but it wasn't normal for you? <laughs> yeah, he at times gets very bored when you know uh, my friends from the industry are sitting, we are talking. He doesn't know anything about them. He doesn't know who's what. For me, who's what? I don't even know what they are talking about. So I am not a branded person. I don't know the designers. I don't know the style. They are talking about a designer from a particular place doing a particular style with a particular person. I'm clueless. I have no clue what it is. And then she's like, "Oh, you, baby, you're feeling left out. Be a part of the conversation." Like, How? I don't know what you guys are talking about. At times, it's so difficult because um, not that he's just not from the industry, also, but uh, he actually doesn't even know many people from the industry. Like very, very famous friends of mine, yeah. very famous celebrities. Okay, uh, we go to parties and they meet him and they talk to him. He doesn't even know him. Like, who is that? I'm like. Just What? Who's that? Then I had to tell him. I had to show him. Like, oh, he's big, huh? Oh, she's big, huh? I don't know. It it actually just happened like that, and that's why I think most of the uh, actors and celebrities yeah. they like it because they don't get like a special treatment from his side. Oh, mm-hmm. like that. Like, they just talk normally, so it's it's very nice that. So, way. are you guys pole apart personalities? Um, <clears throat> I don't know. Maybe, but we both are very uh, big on social life. We like yeah. uh, we like to meet new people. Like-minded people. We like yeah, we like that. But uh, otherwise, in nature, yes, we are a little different from each other. Yeah. <laughs> like proposal in normal scenarios is one thing, 
but when you proposed to her on her birthday almost the entire country was watching like there were paparazzis around you said you are not you are still not used to the cameras abhi there were industry friends around were you nervous before that yeah that's where my profession helped i had down a couple of shots before doing it <laughs> so that's how i got the courage to do it so i could face the lights and cameras mm. and she and she had given a clear cut instruction she's like do not talk because <laughs> i can't talk between brackets if you mm. let me go i am off you tell me don't talk i'll be quiet i don't understand the middle part yeah so i'll just say what i feel like i won't pretend <laughs> and i'm like Mamla this is the first interaction okay this is the first time you're seeing like so many media out there mm-hmm. so uh, if you get nervous or if you don't know what to speak just just don't speak okay this yeah. is the first time just try and observe and know how it works uske baad the then he he was an expert uske baad fir main baithti hu he's always enjoying mm-hmm. with the paps he's talking to all of them i don't oh. know some of them were like at his restaurant also eating and i had no mm-hmm. idea about they just casually came in the sat and had food so yeah, i tell them unko baat karne camera ban ko jitna baat kare camera it's a very different thing for me casually talking to them meeting them i had no idea about like when then fir for next event where we went wahan pe paps the like mere paas aa rahe hai hi akurva sir i'm like ये कब ये कब जानते थे हाँ सर अरे मस्त था खाना बहुत अच्छा था ये वन लाइक ओके दे दे मीट दे मीट तो दैट्स व्हाट ही बट व्हेन ही प्रपोज टू यू यू हैड द स्लाइटेस्ट ऑफ आइडिया कि दिस इज गोइंग टू हैपन सो लॉन्ग बैक ऐसे ही जब व्हेन वी वर जस्ट डिस्कसिंग अबाउट ऑल ऑफ दिस आई आई टोल्ड हिम दैट if something about like this should happen to watch the movie and the proposal of the movie so that yeah. uh, so something on the tv that was going on uh-huh. and she said if i ever want to you continue yeah. if i ever want to have a proposal <laughs> no if i ever want to have a proposal i want all my friends and family yeah. everybody, everybody you know witnessing the event probably that could be the first step shaadi mein bhale log ho na ho that's okay but this thing has to be like that so that was like but 6 7 so months for me proposal was very different for me ek to proposal was never in my head <laughs> and when she said that <laughs> when we watched the movie when she said that my proposal should be with my family and my close friends and all so in my head i was thinking what should my proposal be like the first thing that came into it it should be in a air balloon so nice na boli nahi sakti option nahi hai no with that type yeah and i didn't even know the proposal is so big honestly till it happened yeah for men it's not so big it doesn't really matter the exact thing the ring hope they say yes <laughs> but like you mentioned you are still getting used to the cameras everything right. now to you post pictures with devi on social media it is all over you walk out of the airport there are paparazzis are you still sinking in all of this this entire limelight uh i don't know where i exactly stand because uh, i am a social person but there are times when i like my solitude i like my privacy also so sometimes when it happens when you are not expecting it to happen that's when it's a task and as i said i'm not a designer person i don't understand things yeah. so if i'm ever going somewhere out let's say like come to an event or come to a birthday party friend so first question is are there paps going to be there so like yes then think me last time kya pehna tha i should not repeat the same clothes mera udhar se chalu ho jata hai for me the thinking starts from there so my biggest question when the paps what should i be wearing Yeah. Well, so that's otherwise right. I am you know, absolutely okay. Earlier it was never the case, but now he prepares a little bit. You know, okay, acha, abhi jana hai. The fact that here, here, pe paps honge, ye honge. So, mujhe kya pehna chahiye? Ye pehna. Then he last me also send me picture. Should I wear this? What are you wearing? Oh, that's why we asked. So, considering all of that, do you think he has already stepped a lot out of his comfort zone? Yes, he has. he has definitely i mean um, it's not easy to handle you know a lifestyle like this it's not easy to yeah. be in the limelight always and you know like for him it's like it's for him it was never needed and like tomorrow if it's not there it's it's absolutely fine but then the whole pressure of you know being presentable i think he takes it very nicely he takes it very gracefully he doesn't have a problem with it you know also it's very difficult uh, honestly especially for a country like india for men to come to terms that their wife is more successful and more popular mm-hmm. and uh, for me somehow i i feel very happy about it i'm very yeah. proud about it more than feeling uh, left out or more than feeling uh, unwanted at a place i feel very proud that she gets a lot of attention because she deserves it she's earned it her own way so i feel very proud about it when something like that thing happen i think i think that south the gate should be throughout i never want to uh be more successful there and her i'd rather you be successful peeche khada i'll be very happy doing that 
You deserve it. You're going to have it. It's as simple as that. So, but half people told you, say, for example, to an event where both of you have to go, maybe some family function, and she couldn't make it. Half people told you, ki, why isn't she here? Busy profession. Oh, my identity has changed. We were at a at a <laughs> lounge one day having a drink with a friend of mine. At the bar, and I come see, you're Devi Agarwal's husband, na? And my friend is rolling on the floor, literally laughing. He says, these are from your profession. They don't know you. They know her. And we are laughing over it. So yeah. But one aspect of this profession is also trolling. It could be regarding anything. Actors have still, I mean, unfortunately, fortunately, right. gotten used to. They know how right. to deal with it. But as a partner, do you feel angry or upset when, say, somebody writes something negative so about I'll be you? honest, very honest. When first time it happened and they were discussing, so she and her friend were sitting and they were troll over there. I looked at them and said, what is trolling? For me, it started there. I didn't know what trolling was. So for me, social media was talking people and just seeing things and all that. We were not, I was never so active on it. I was active, but for it was never on my identity. Yeah. Now it's suddenly turned around. It's like you have a CCTV all over you all the time and people are trolling. <laughs> then I said, it just make me angry. Then I started laughing. Then I started having my own kicks or I started finding grammatical mistakes in the trolls. <laughs> then I started adopting those terms. <laughs> Next time in the middle of a fight, I use those terms. It's <laughs> like funny term with a spelling mistake. <laughs> So, uh, but I feel very sad. I mean, it's not about uh, we being angry about it. I feel, I feel very sad that people have so much hate inside them. They should change it because that just makes them unhappy. It doesn't make the other person anything, you know. And so, uh, like, they should be happy about themselves. I mean, it's too much of hate. That's the only thing that makes it very sad. You may be, say, you, you may have learned the art of how to ignore or deal with it. But now, the fact that you, ha you also have a partner, does that... Does that thought ki, okay, he's also reading, what if he's bothered? Does that cross your mind? Honestly, uh, initially, yes. Initially, it was like, I was uh, very uh, kind of scared to show that side of my world because it's very dark that way. So, I thought that if he sees all of this, he sees all of this, he might get affected, you know. He wouldn't even tell me because he's not like at first very expressive. He takes time to express things. So, uh, I'm like, if he bad, he won't tell me because he knows that, you know, it will kind of uh, play a wrong uh, thing in my yeah. head. That, yeah, uh, I don't like it. I should do something about it. I should do something. And I'll get anxious that I should do something. But initially, it happened. But then when uh, <coughs> he saw that I'm ignoring and I'm enjoying my life and everything yeah. is okay, then he also started adapting that. In fact, like, if it happens, it will be a little bit upset that, yeah, what is this yeah why is it happening now that everything is cool and sorted i'm just working i'm just doing this so now when i get upset then looking at me he gets upset he doesn't get upset because of the trolling he like you don't get upset you know it's not worth yeah. it yeah so yeah but shifting focus what about your marriage plan <laughs> <coughs> that's what i normally tell people <laughs> and people who are married would know it very well i don't have a say Shut up! <laughs> the woman decides. Shut up! Next year. Next year, yeah. for sure. But is there pressure from family also? No, no, not at all. Not at all. Nor his parents, nor my family. No pressure like that. But then, the pressure is like... See, Shadi is like uh, very nice. It's very sweet, everything. So, after that, there's a planning. There's a prep hota hai matlab kai bar sab log baith ke sochte bhi hai ki acha kya kare kya what month what date when hmm. the minute we start thinking about like oh it's too stressful there's so much to think <laughs> pehle ye karna hai fir wo karna hai yeah there are times when she said once ki uh, let's do a court marriage and hmm. like, why do you want to involve the government in this the relationship is going fine that's the only thing that we are going to do we would add some paperwork to it but like you mentioned, next year, do you guys have a fixed month date something? Nothing at all right now. Nothing but at all But right nothing now. at all. Actually, I was also very busy with all the work that has been coming. Sir, my dinner ka plan ka timing fix nahi hota because of a schedule. <laughs> You're talking about something few months, something project comes, it'll be gone for six months. <laughs> yeah. Before we wrap up, we have a small game for you. I have certain chits. Each one of you will pick that chit. Aapne uthaya, so he will tell you that particular, like he'll have to answer that particular thing okay, okay. about you and vice versa. Okay, okay. Yeah. Up okay, thank you. Up hmm. <coughs> Should I go? Yep. Yeah. Chupa kyo reo? Anyway, just approach say it. No, I have to answer ask about him. him. No, no, you ask him and he will answer on your behalf. Oh, For example, okay. if it says your favorite food item, uh -huh. he will have to guess okay. what it is. So, beaches or mountains? I like beaches or mountains. Depends on your mood. 
Right now the mountains. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Now our pools. So we'll pick four chits each. Hmm. Earlier it was beaches. Now I'm like moving towards the mountains. Favorite movie? Hmm. Your favorite movie? Oh my god, there are so many <laughs> shit. This is this is tough. Let's cut down to Hindi. Bollywood. Uh, oh, courtroom drama, wo 13 people in the courtroom. What's the name of Ek the movie? Ek Rukha Hua Faisla. Ek Rukha Hua Faisla, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. right answer. Yes, see? We should play that at home also, this is fun. No, no. Aise hi, better, better. 3AM friend. Mera 3AM friend. <laughs> so many. Guy or a girl? Any, any, any. Snare Jeet? <laughs> if he's awake and his phone is on. <laughs> yes, hundred mm. percent. Okay. शादी कब कर रहे हो? हैं? No, everyone keeps asking that all the time. <laughs> favorite Bollywood actor? Huh. Your favorite Bollywood actor? Mm. Actor, actress. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, he really likes Parish Rawal. He really likes Is that a right answer? Yes. So for oh. me, as I said, an actor is someone who can portray everything. He can be a villain oh, and a comedian yeah. at the same time. Yeah. Ooh, I'm going, see, I'm going fine. Abhi tak 100 out of 100 sal raha. Hello? <laughs> see, favorite hobby. <coughs> Aapki favorite hobby? Hmm? Gossip. What? Gossip? <laughs> no, what? No. Uh, no, gardening. Gardening, oh. yes. <laughs> Actually, I don't Again, know. Again, the right answer. Huh? Oh, second, pata nahi. Second? Hey, second. Boxing, dancing. Boxing? I thought that was personal. <coughs> no. <laughs> Hobby. <again. laughs> okay. <coughs> Delhi or Mumbai? Oh, this to Mumbai for both of us. <laughs> <laughs> Mumbai, meri jaan. Nothing better than Mumbai. Rom com or thrillers? He hates rom com. Huh? He hates rom com movies. He gets so bored with rom com movies. He just I found rom also comedy. <laughs> Romantic comedy like the way people do it here. <laughs> My turn. Now Apul's turn. Yes. Clubbing or binge watching at home? <laughs> clubbing for sure. Apul likes clubbing. Do you want to pick more? <laughs> Yeah. One last, chalo. One last. Oh, we are just... Dinner date or a movie date? Uh, he fancies more dinner dates, I guess. He likes sweet. Of course, okay. because of the... Profession. Yeah, because I don't think movie is a date because I'm too engrossed in the movie yeah. if I'm watching yeah. it. Hmm. So, yeah. Yay! <laughs> we did last. Well. <laughs> Food item I hate. Okay, I, I know this, I know this. Uh, Loki, Kaddu, Palak, <laughs> all of those uh, categories so of vegetables. So many. Which we avoid in childhood, that's now. Veg. I'm a vegetarian. <laughs> and oh. he doesn't like veg. Yeah, hmm. cruelty to plant. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much guys for Thank joining so us. It was Thank lovely you. talking to you. Same all way. the very best. Thank you, Thank you so, so much. much. Hello everybody. Hi, this is Apurva. This is Divya and you guys are watching News 18 Shosha. <laughs>